everybody. Welcome, Welcome to our Yay! I just happened to notice that Quantro is much stronger than I realized it was. I thought it was uh, like some of the other liqueurs where it might be in like the 20% range. It's like 40%. And that's when I got the thought that, okay, it could actually be a base liquor for a drink. To start, bring out the Quantro. Normally for one drink, uh, we'll do one shot, but for this drink, we're gonna do two shots because I'm making one for myself and one. So one day, Ryan brought home this big bag of flowers. Sorrel flowers. Uh, the lady at the market told me to put in uh, clove, anise, and cinnamon. Boil it all up with a big pot and then straighten everything. On its own, it's very tart. So we added quite a bit of agave to cut down the bitterness. Here's our homemade sorrel. So we'll put two shots of this sorrel in. One. I made some iced tea. I kind of blended a bunch of different teas. It's got some mint, some mango, and just some black tea. Okay. Yeah. So for the last one, we'll add in the iced tea. Three and four. A nice big chunk of ice. Keep it cold for a while. Great. Oh yeah. On the island, nothing is as it seems. But limes look like lemons. Oranges look like... Lemons as well. And sometimes grapefruit look like yes. lemons. <laughs> to garnish this, we're going to use two oranges. Boom, boom. And there you go. Cool. Cool. Okay. Thanks for joining us tonight. Cheers to you and cheers to you. Cheers. To it. And so we added. So we. Yeah. Radio.